A cyclist who was hit by a car and left for dead see, says he was struck with such force he thought he'd been paralysed. The shocking incident comes as a new study reveals one-fifth of Australians have chased someone after being consumed by road rage. Christabel Valencia rides to work in Docklands every day. But on Thursday, that routine almost killed him after being struck by a turning vehicle. Hit my head, fell off the car, straight onto the pavement, hit my head there, and that's when I felt the hit, going like, oh, this is not going to be good. It wasn't. He suffered a number of injuries, although the impact wasn't enough to concern the driver at fault. At that point, I go, so where's the guy hit me? And it turns out that he took off. He literally just hit me and took off. And he hasn't been seen since. Christabel understands the initial incident was an accident, although he says failing to check on his well-being should have consequences. But it's no surprise Mr Valencia's experience isn't an isolated one. A recent study into road rage conducted by Monash University has found our roads are becoming increasingly dangerous, with almost 20% of drivers admitting to chasing someone out of anger. We see males and females are both engaging in this type of behaviour. And one of the things, of course, is that it's surprising when you see it so widespread across the board. The study also found almost 50% of people surveyed admitted to tailgating and 86% expressed anger, yep, you guessed it, like this. Michael Scanlon, 7 News.